Well, hey guys, this is Rick here anyway. Uh, yeah, you know what that is. That's the DeLorean. And I got the Back to the Future Part 1 right behind it here. See that? Yeah. See that? Oh, I'm just making fun of myself on the video. It's not bad. It looks pretty decent. That's uh, the Sunbeam Company. Get the part three ones when it's... See it on the train track. And then this is like the... Got like the 50s wheels. That's the part two one back there. Let's see. I'm doing a real close-up of this one. Ooh. Yeah, so... Yeah, this one here, you know, it's got the pop-up wheels, so it's like in hover conversion, like, look at it, it's flying over the, the other ones, like, whoop, I'm not going to sit on you guys, might need you for another uh, episode, I don't know if that made sense, but anyway, okay, so, yeah, um, I love Back to the Future. I wish I had the money to get that really expensive one, the $600, $700 model. But, uh, ah, that's too much money for me. And whoever can get it, well, hey, that's great. That's, that's a lot of money for a model, a model car, you know? Well, those, that door stayed up a little bit. I think the doors are too heavy. It doesn't want to stay up too good. I think one of them will stay up. Is it this one? Maybe this one. Ah, it's always that door. The other door doesn't want to, want to stay on it. Oh, maybe this one. Well, anyway, I, I didn't really have a lot to say about them. It's just a little... Video, you could tell this is the original DeLorean. It's got this pop up thing. You get it to pop up. Oh, yeah, there's the motor inside DeLorean Motor Companies. I think they did a pretty good job, Sunbeam, on this company. Looks pretty good, you know? Well, I guess you get what you pay for. Yeah. Well, yeah, check it out, alright? Check out my video.